Hi, in this video you will learn all about the uh, Lestvi Pearson website and more specifically the SSO system that uh, I will show you how to log into. So you will first want to, on your Google browser, uh, go to the Lestvi Pearson website, which the address is highlighted right up there, so boardsite.lbpsb.qc.ca. Once you're on the website, you will see that there are all kinds of information regarding the um, school board itself, uh, as well as different things that has to do with uh, the school board or different meetings that has to do with council of commissioners and so on. Once you scroll down, you will see that there are all kinds of widgets, two of them that we are most interested in, SSO system and continuing education. So the SSO system, you click only once, it will open, get you to a place where you need to log on. You will put in your username as well as the password that the school board gave you. When you log in, you will see different options of what you could look along on. So what you will consistently have to log on will be mostly the Grix and Tosca. Um, which we will come back to. You have in there all kinds of different information, your personal payroll information that you might want to look into, professional development, um, and uh, taxes uh, and slips that you might want to look into for when your paycheck would come in. So if we're looking to Greg's and Tosca, click once only, then it's going to ask you for your Tosca username as well as your Tosca password. These are provided to you by the school board or by your center secretary. So once you go on, you have a new menu. The two portions that we're really looking into is SCWT or the attendance and horaire de l'enseignant or your own teacher schedule. When we go into SCWT, new menu opens. It's asking you to choose from a group. So when you click on the arrow, all the different groups that you would be teaching within a year are going to show up. Select the group that you want to choose. And then it's going to show you the group itself for the days uh, within seven days that you are um, scheduled to teach with. The only time where you can put attendance has to do with the times where you are the one who's teaching that group. So by example, I was teaching that group on um, January 6th in the morning. So therefore, it's telling me the students that are in the group, the competency that I'm teaching, as well as different periods that uh, I was in there. So I would select whoever student would be uh, absent because by default, it gives you absent. And then once you select it, it is important that you would click on the bottom part saying that you've complete the selection. Then you would put in your ID code as well as password and click on uh, Enregistrer. So this is for the student portion. If we're looking at your portion, which is Ara de l'enseignant, when you click on it, it's giving you per week your schedule. By default, the only thing that will appear is the schedule that was entered by the center secretary, so the actual teaching schedule. It would be your job to put in times where you do something else than teaching if you are contracted. So by example, here I did enter the different uh, things that I was doing throughout days. Um, when you want to enter something, you would want to click on New. Then, as you can see, the top section here is empty. I would want to enter a date starting by the year, followed by the month, and followed by the day. At what time the activity that I did started, at what time the activity that I did finished. I do not need to put the duration. It's going to be uh, enabled by itself. Then I have to choose from the scrolling menu what I did on that day. So I'm going to say that I did comp task on that day, and then I would click on Enregistrer, and it is going to show up there. If I scroll a little bit down, it's giving me a total of what I did within my week. I can put uh, personal notes at the bottom. Uh, these are available for me only to see. And that is pretty much what I need to know about uh, the SSO system and the Toscanet portion. I need to close it. 
And that is it. Thank you.